Okay. I know. See, she wants to be in the video. That's kind of nice. I'm going to put like an album out. I got a little <laughs> cute dog in this thing right here. Hey everybody, my name is Chris from Casual Fragrances. I'd like to thank uh, my guest Kevin for being on the channel. He's it's been a while, we're, we're doing the quarantine match, but a lot of cities are uplifting and we're doing good now, so I had a chance to spend a little bit of time with him and his friends. Trust just doesn't care. No, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't know, Kanye West ain't got that bad. Yeah, you know, but a lot of states open up now, so I figured we'd do a fragrance video together. It's been a long time. Yeah, it's been and a long um, time. his birthday is like, what, tomorrow, man? Yeah, actually, it is tomorrow. Oh, um, man. With that, I, I, I didn't even ask for anything. I was like, look, I'm going to put out an EP. So me and my buddy Mike, uh, Mike Max, we were working out for probably, I don't know, since like September. So it's been about like, I feel like it's been like a year already. It's been, it's been a long time. I, I feel like I've been inside, man. I came outside, I was all like pale, looking like Roger from the working out. But um, we, we were working on music and I was like, you know what? I got plenty of time to do it. So I, I, I've been quarantined. I've been in the studio just working on some stuff. And, I, and like I said, for my for my birthday, I'm putting it out there. So I want you guys to go check it out. It's going to be I'm going to leave all the information down yeah. below. If you I'm not going to tell you what it is. down here. Today we're going to talk about these fragrances. These fragrances are more expensive. These are not the designers you buy at Macy's or Sephora. This is more like Saks, Neiman Marcus, um, Nordstrom, yeah. more high-end fragrances. And you want to smell different. You want to smell like everybody else. So I'm going to let them try out two of these fragrances. They're very expensive. They're between $200 to $400 for a fragrance. But you get a discount for like $150 to $180. But he's going to be real with you if he likes it, he doesn't. So you he's more of a consumer that wants to smell good. One. He doesn't care about the, the brand. He wants to smell good and get compliments. Yeah, so, I, mean, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> First one oh, is got. from Rouge Parfum. This is Elysium. This one is from London. So I'm gonna spray this on a card for him. Check and the design, out. design the, is beautiful. What, okay, what box is it coming in? Because you know, oh, like, I, I don't mind. I don't oh, mind wow. the boxes. Like, the box is pretty cool, like this. Okay. That cool little transformer kind of symbol. That, that, yeah. Slides up like this. Cool presentation. The back has your information. 100 ml bottle. This retails for like 290. But you can get it for like. 200 in the great market. Yeah. So see that I mean that matters sometimes. I do sometimes I will keep my my cologne in the box. Okay. Like if, if I'm traveling. So like something like this, it's it's a nice design, but it's it, I think it's a little what's he bulky for Too me? Kind of heavy I, kind of like I mean not that I care about that. I wouldn't I wouldn't save the box, but I do like saving certain boxes like for like unboxing videos and oh, stuff. Oh definitely like that. something to show nice yeah, presentation. Yeah, definitely. So While he smells this, I'm gonna go over the notes. It is a beautiful bottle it's presentation, nice. I know. I mean it's just you put that in your counter, people are like, oh, what fragrance is that? You know, like that gold, yeah. that real gold? Like, yeah, real gold, but I need to clean that. Like he smells this, I'm going to go over note breakdown it. So this fragrance, you can get a sample for about $10 $12 for 5 mil. Has notes of lemon, bergamot, grapefruit, lime, lavender, Ooh. thyme, assise, musk. We have lily the valley, we got rose, winter, guys. jasmine, <laughs> geranium, pink pepper, Casipso, vetiver, cedar, juniper berries, benzoin, vanilla, lavender, musk, leather, and amber. So there's a lot of notes in this fragrance. I'm sorry, guys. But... Yeah, you got, I know. I, I have my animals. Yeah, that's with my Illuminati cat right here. His name's the Governor. <laughs> this is a, a for me personally. I feel like it's a fresh citrus fragrance. But I'm gonna see what Kevin how he feels about how you feel about it, man. Uh, I, I actually like this a lot. This, oh, uh, wow. You know how I rate stuff, uh, and sometimes I'm like, it's you're too real much. critical too. You don't, I, I you don't just say, oh, I like it. Like, look, I don't like that. No, like, I, 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 I think it sucks. You, you are, you are honest. you're not like, yo. I'm not gonna hype this if I don't like it. Whatever. So th this isn't something. This isn't like something that's like a musk. Like it's not like it's like it's it, it, it's it's a. Uh, it's not a pungent or too strong of a smell. It's actually kind of light and, mm -hmm. and it has that citrusy smell. So I mean, if you were like, if I was going to the Bahamas or something like that, I would definitely have this out there on the beach or something like that. You know, if you're yeah. like, after you're going to nice dinner or something like that, it's that tropical smell. It's not gonna offend anybody. I don't. Feel no, like. no. I, I'll, I'll be honest with you. I would give this. You know, I never, I never should have done. Oh, no, no. We, we do 1 to 10. And yeah. you, you, you're you honest. You don't just say, hey, everything's a 10. No, no. I, I would actually give this a 9. That, that, that's the, the highest I, I go. But that, that is a, that's a 9 is a 10 in your world. So, I mean, I mean like, you know, like, because, like, you rate, you, you're, you're very, you're not yeah. very critical. He'll, t he'll tell you something. But, like, this is, like, this is, I, I like that. I would actually buy that. Right, cool. If you have samples or whatever and, and someone wins a, what's the name? This is probably the best sample of cologne you're going to get. So, I'm going to let it spray it on the skin real quick and see how it feels about it now. So, yeah. Oh, there you go. See, see. I a couple sprays, see if he likes to let it settle for a second. But see how, because sometimes paper smells good, but sometimes on skin, doesn't smell as good. So see how he feels about it on your skin. Yeah, settle for a couple for a seconds bit. here. Yeah, man. No I do like that. I like that. Not that bad. Oh, all my skin, too. Not, and not just because, like you said, sometimes if you spray it on the actual sample stick, it does smell. A little it smells, bit yeah. It's like, oh, it smells good, but like, but it smells the same on my skin or not. As Chris would call it, it doesn't have that, what do you call it, the, the, the skin chemistry? Yeah, sometimes <laughs> skin chemistry ain't that good. I, I've had some. 
bad skin chemistry with fragrances. So no, this, you like that. This 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 is actually nice. Like the, I would actually, I have a hard time finding um, good ones that I don't get tired of, and that's one of those where I can I can that's gonna last me a, a, a while. A hundred bottle, yeah. <laughs> you so, don't do too many sprays. You don't no, do too many no, sprays. definitely, definitely. Oh, cool. So do you feel like this still a, a nine on your skin, or different from the the rating you gave it on paper? Um, I get overall, like, even after smelling it, I still give it a nine. Like nine? It, it, it is a good smell. now. I'm rating it off of just the first, my first, yeah, opening first smell, reaction. Right? But if I were to wear that for uh, eight hours, kind of see what the longevity is. Okay. I, I think that maybe I, I could change, but at, right right now, you like I, it. I, I like it off off the off the road. Yeah, cool. I'm gonna try another fragrance, but not for a long time. This fragrance is more for expensive. Eight. This one is pretty expensive. So this is about a good four hundred, five hundred dollar fragrance, but you get discounted for like around two something. So I'm gonna see what he how he feels about it. A lot of people like this, but let's see his personal Let me opinion. See the box. Oh, let's see the box. So the box presentation is nice. Real black, it has right. and inside it has a little presentation of the owner and his son of uh, just you know about the See, company. This is, and but this is the stuff. shit I'm talking about. I'm really? sorry for cursing. No, no problem. But like this is the stuff I'm talking about. Very detailed, yeah. you know, ordinate okay, everything. Yeah, you know, people can see it. Oh no. It's fine. It's I'm fine. sorry. We'll get it later. It's fine. I'm, it's just I'm sorry, I'll oh, don't eat that. But if, if, <laughs> if you don't, but there's there's like a, a there's always like something weird in the box. Yeah. And it just like almost like gives you like the history one. And it's like it's just stuff that you don't think of. I'm like, they don't, some people just want to buy a fragrance, but like there's a story behind most fragrances, like where they come from, who like made them. their fragrance. So not the best looking box, but it's something you know. It's nice. all right. It's, it's all right. I mean, I'm not mad. I said, you know, I wouldn't do it right in the trash. Sorry. <laughs> I would keep the cologne now, but I mean, I mean, I, maybe. So while he smells, I'm gonna go over a no break right. now. You can get samples of this too. I'll leave a link down below. So it has black currant. Italian bergamot, French apple, we have rose, we have dry birch, we have jasmine, patchouli, musk, oak moss, and we recent vanilla. Okay. So, this, this, so I, I, uh, I would, I would consider myself a, uh, like an apprentice carpenter. I, 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 I like, I, I actually like uh, the smell of this because I like okay. carpentry, like, you know, like, I like to build, yeah. I like to build something like that, so that, that it, I do smell that birch in there, so I, I, that's the first thing I smell. Okay. Um, it, it wouldn't be something I would wear all the time. It's, okay. it, it's, it's too strong, but too if strong? I, it, it's, it's not too strong, but it's too, I would only put one spray of that on, and I, I think I'd be I'd be good probably all day. But I think that one I would give that one I would give that a six and a half. Not not that it's not good. It's it's okay. it's, it's really good, but it's Ooh. not something it's not something that I could wear all the time. Oh like, man! Now do you wear now, now do you, you know what? Pick, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give my buddy a smell on this, and, and, and I'm gonna see if he, uh, see if he oh, can tell right His name's Vinny. Um, he's, he's a good buddy of mine. We're, we actually have a, a podcast together. It's called One White Guy, One Black Guy. So I'm gonna actually let see what he's. Let me get so this bottle right here was the first bottle spray, correct? Yep. You want to wear this bottle if you're in New York and you're going to spend about five thousand dollars on dinner. You smell very fucking professional. <laughs> right. You're fine. Go ahead. All right. Now this bottle here. All right. Now I don't know how you want this <laughs> for my single men. <laughs> That's this is the bottle you spray on before you go out Friday night, look for thoughts in South Philly. Yeah. All right. That's why you're the one white guy and the one black This guy. is the good <laughs> stuff. I recommend the more expensive bottle. Now I'm going to bring on Mike. I'm going to spray each one on his skin. He's going to tell me which one he prefers. He's not getting paid any money. I'm not getting paid any money at all. These nah, fragrances. Nah, 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 so let's nah. just see how he feels. So this first one is Elysium. Spray on your skin. Wait, wait, wait. All right. Elysium is going to be on his right. This is Elysium. Smell it first. See how you feel. Yo. Just buy off, like just watch. Looking at that bottle, the beautiful bottle. Huh? Yeah, I've wanted to smell it this whole time <laughs> watching you guys do it. Okay, three takes. Three takes. All right, have you eaten frame a little more? All right, the three no problem. All right, so you are you really liking it? Like a little bit? How you feel about it? It's okay. It's okay. I, I thought it would be better. better? It's, a, it's okay. a nice, it's not fun. It, it's, I think it's like beach, like California sun a lot. Like yeah. during the wintertime, I may not want to smell yeah. like that. But that smells really good though. Okay. That is a night out on dinner though. That's no. a nice So night. what would you give from one to ten on your skin? 7.4. 7 okay. Now we're going to do a Ventus. So we'll see if you like this one. So we'll bring other skin here. See if you like this one. Put it right here. Let's see if you like that. Let's yes. for a second and see if he likes this one. Now, Ventus has notes of uh, pretty much here we have birch, we have uh, bergamot, pineapple, apple, birch, jasmine, patchouli, musk, oak moss, amber grease, and vanilla. So, see how he feels about this fragrance here. So, I must be too country. <laughs> <laughs> These jokes are terrible, man. You don't like them? Did you not beat a good oh, Muslim oil? Which one did you say? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> 
Wow. He's being I, honest. This one, it real. This one's like a 5.2. 5.2? This is a 7.4 by far. Yeah, that's All right. Bad. Is it a different when it gets right on you? No, nah, this one was this one was okay. Like I would use this if I had it, like spinning okay. around. See, that's the one I thought I smelled in the end. The second one. Right? Yeah, that is this. This it one smells is... so good from back end. Yeah, yeah it that's, that's the thing. It's confusing. Right. But this one is like a, a yeah. Give me a spray. Give me a spray. Sure. Spray that one if you want. I'll let him spray Lucian, but that's how you feel. Give him a second to let it settle and see if he likes it more. If he doesn't, let him try weird. Elysium. So it does. It actually, it's crazy. I never it has that. a way different smell. Whoa! <laughs> hey, look at him. He's it's like his way. Damn. It's like that's some rich shit, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I think the other guy's gonna change. This the is opinion. like going back to another five thousand dollar dinner, man. It's like, <laughs> I mean, don't worry, this if we're going south. Like, they get don't get mugged. Mug. This is different. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh man, this is definitely a rich uh -oh. Okay, so do you want to spray it other on your skin? Yeah, let me get it. Right. Whoa! At least let me see if you spray skin. See if he feels differently or same. So. Leave it out. These are from people that like fragrances as much as I do, but they're not jumping into niche for a lot of these guys like designer fragrances, so I'm gonna have them smell these and see if they feel this like which one is better or not. So, you know, see how it goes. Okay. This one. It definitely is better on your skin. Okay, then this one. Yes. Okay, so, so this I one will give this. An eight. An eight? I'm giving that an eight? Okay. And I would give this. After, like, just smelling it in the air, because I, I don't know this how. This one, it's simply. It's because it's weird, because now if I smell it in the air how I smelled it originally, I'd be like, this thing's a 10. Okay. But now when I smell it up close and personally, I'm like, eh, it's about. On your skin, does it, does it smell better? It on still your skin smells or? good, but it just smells more of like an older man cologne now. Okay, older man Instead of like what I originally thought, like a night out on the town. It definitely tail. smells like that. Like I, yeah. would, I would give this. If I was to go somewhere nice, okay, like a fancy restaurant, yes, or something? Okay. I would wear this, and then I could rate it properly. Okay, I would give it. So, like a suit and tie, what would you rate it? On yourself, wearing like a six point five. Okay, mm. okay. Now let's try the other one. Now for a suit and tie, what would you rate this one? I'm, I'll go nine to that. Nine. Okay, yeah. no problem. All right, I'm gonna have Kevin back on and have his final thoughts on it, and we'll wrap this thing up. The other two guys have different opinions. Now, I know the other guy came when he liked it events, but he liked the Elysium more on his skin. Look, Chris, I've been watching your videos since day one. And they're scrubs, <laughs> and they don't know the process of how you're supposed to put cologne on, and I didn't know either. So this is a true testimony to show you that sometimes you smell cologne in the air, and it smells really, really good. But when you put it on, it may just perspire, or, yeah. you know, it makes Skin chemistry body. might it be changes, good, it changes bad, it, it might be sour, yeah. you don't like it. Yeah. You know? Like I said, I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with, uh, a nine for this because this smells like some just it's going to me, nine with Elysium. Okay, to me religion. now, how much was the price again? This is two nine. We can get it for like 200 at great market yeah. discounted, so 200 yeah. bucks well, for 100 right. bottle. And it's gonna last, I, bottles gonna last I, I, what, what, if I were to spend money, would I spend money on this? I, I, if I, yeah, I would. If I, if I was gonna buy a, if I was gonna buy, if I was gonna buy a cologne, <laughs> I, I would get that. Okay, um, I would spend the money on that because I know that it would last me long because I don't need to spray that much on no. two sprays was, was good for me. Um, with Creed, okay. Now with Creed, sometimes I either get that too strong of a smell, or it doesn't last as long. Okay. And, and, and not 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 just just for me, for for, for you, I think you said it, sometimes it does. It, you get to yeah. And you can't seven, go no spray hours. Spray your suit, when you smell it, you can smell it for like an hour, and you might not smell. But it, yeah. the notes in it can make you go nose wise, so you don't smell it for hours. But people around, yeah. people like can smell it like for hours. How so. much is this? Like ninety bucks? Oh um, no, you, it's about about one eighty one. That's on discount. Right? Yeah. The price is four hundred. <laughs> so you're saying like two hundred bucks. <laughs> but I mean, the fragrance that you only one or two All sprays right. and. It's not. Nice. I know, like the aroma that this gives, but yeah. I, what I don't like is, I don't like that it doesn't last as long, and I feel like maybe it's not a little, um, it's not, it, it's it just, it's too pungent of a smell to wear all the time. Okay. So it would be one of those that get pushed further and further and further back into your, your cabinet as you get a different cologne, because you're like, I like this one, this is like for special occasions. Uh, so like, dressed up, getting married, going on dates, a uh, family reunion. Yeah, if I met my girl, like when I met my girl back in the day, I would have sprayed this when we went on our first date, and okay. I think it still would have went just as well. A nice but, memory scent. But it would have been one of those scents where she doesn't forget that smell. My, you know, my grandfather always had a cologne, like he always wore cologne, and sometimes he put too much on, but like, <laughs> he had good smell in cologne. So like, I, 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 have, I do have a good scent for cologne, but no, this, this, I would say this one wins it for me.
today. So you think people should try both and get a sample? I, Which one do you think they should lean to trying out? You think? I think the Elysium is, is my is is, is my go-to. I'm telling you guys right now, I like it, but trust me, I, I Chris has shown me a lot of the colognes, and out of all the ones we, the videos we've done. This is top. This is top dollar. You know what? I'm giving it a ten, actually. You giving it a ten now? I'm giving it a 10. So again, ten off your skin. I'm talking ten for price wise. It, it, it is expensive. It's like two hundred. I give it a nine price. because I give it a nine because that price just killed me. It, so I think it was under off. like one fifty, maybe. But for the fragrance, I give it a ten. I give it a ten. Over overall nine though for for the price. Um, how, how long? I have to check, test how long. So my longevity on my skin, my very yours, mine, I get about six hours. Six hours. But some people might get seven. Some people get eight. I think it's the summertime. Seven. I'm sweating a lot. So summertime. I'll, I'll, it's going to be all. It's, it's going to project hours. a lot more louder. Yeah. But yeah. I mean, but I, I do like the presentation of it. Yeah. Price is expensive, well, but you're walking. You're getting from like a viewer survival dish now. You're stepping your game up to something like this. Oh yeah. But, yeah. I mean, if you like those fragrances, you're going to like this one. But yeah. it's expensive, so I would suggest get ten, ten to eight hour Sorry, samples and try it out first. So, I'd like to thank Kevin for part of the video. Now, Kevin's gonna talk about his podcast, one of his special guests. I'm gonna walk away from the screen for a minute. Buddy Vin right here, we have a podcast called One White Guy, One Black Guy. And pretty much with the uh, the premise of that, that podcast is just to show that, obviously, I'm one black guy. I'm one white guy. And it's sometimes, it's hard for um, him to understand uh, some, some things that I go through in life, and, and sometimes I don't understand how he sees it, and, and we learn from each other, and that's something that we try to project on this podcast. And we're best buds. Yeah, we work together too, actually. Yeah. I think we've been working together for almost a year, but it just, it, it feels like, like my buddy Mike, it, to, but all through it, it feels like we've been friends since we were like kids. Yes. Uh, and so with that, my buddy Mike, he helped me out, um, just get some things ready for my actual... Oh, no, no, stay back, stay back, um, stay back. Get You guys messed up that smooth glide. No, no, I just so, thought we would just all get on this bit, small couch together. So Mike uh, stopped me out more on the, on the music side, and and um, we've been doing what since uh, September yeah, of September. 2019. Yeah. I was like, dude, we gotta get together, and we linked up. It was, what three days? It was like three, three yeah, days. Three we days. We music. Like had some music. Yeah. And the first song we put out was, was fire. Uh, Mike, you said you're putting out an EP soon, too, right? Soon, yeah. Soon. No date, you know. I'm always like that, but soon. Following up his, you just gotta listen to his first and then you'll know that what's coming next is Definitely. fire too. Definitely. So Night Mode comes out tonight, it's for my birthday. It comes out on Spotify, comes out on Apple Music, you guys can get it on Amazon, you guys can get it on anything, even way back in Nasser, YouTube, you can get it anywhere. Guys, come check it out. Chris, thanks for having me. Oh, thanks I'm for our podcast down too. Below also check out one white guy, one black guy podcast. Check our podcast down there, please check out Night Mode and be looking out from uh Mike's Max's EP too soon. I think it's coming out soon. I don't know when, but it's coming out soon. I'm gonna leave yeah. all the information down below so you can definitely show them some support. The podcast cool. I will be featured in one of the videos. I'm not sure what's one yet, but I will be featured in one of the videos and it'd be cool. You guys can hear my perspective on life and fragrances yeah. too. So from a different uh, element than me being on camera, being on a podcast. So I'm excited for it. I thank Kevin for being on my channel. Thanks, brother, man. I hope everybody stays safe during this rough time. I know it's a critical time in life. We're all like a little scared about, you know, the whole racial thing and the whole coronavirus. Hope everybody stays safe. I care about each and every one of you guys. And if you like the channel, please start clicking that subscribe button, hit the like button, leave a comment down below. More videos are coming soon. Thank you, Kevin. Yeah, man. Peace.